Hey YouTube, it's Stephanie, and I'm back again today with another video, Sunday the 10th. Um, like I said in my previous video, if you go check that out, I'm starting a playlist of my makeup collection, and I'm going to break it down into sections, because like I said, I have a couple thousand products. Easy. Between brushes, tools, you name it. And I just feel that I don't want to make a video for you guys. It's like six hours long. So, because that would just be ridiculous to no degree. So, I have things broken up in like categories and like by brand and stuff like that. So, that's what I'm going to do. But right now, I'm going to bring to you like um, a little mix basket that I have of stuff. Um, I will do swatches of everything on my arm, of course. Um, once again, I've got somewhere to go, so can't do lip swatches. But if you do want me to do lip swatches, let me know in the comments down below. Um, also, if you have any questions, feel free to send me a private message or um, hit me up on one of my social media accounts. Information will be down in the description box. Um, you can also hit me up here on the comments. Um, what else do I want to say? So, anyways, um, and if you have a YouTube channel and you subscribe to my channel and like and subscribe, you want to. Nobody's forced here. Um, it's all in good fun. Um, I will let me know in the comments and I will go to your channel and I will also subscribe to your channel. Because if you support me, I'm always going to support you 100%, whether you're a big fish or a little fish in the YouTube seat. So, with that being said, let's get started because I have about... 20 that I want to do for you, uh, but I'm going to break this first part up into, because I only have a few of these particular items, and um, they are kind of recent purchases, so let's go with that. So the first products I'm going to show you are going to be these Santi Metallic uh, Lipstick Long Lasting, and they are in funky colors, and I have color 1, 2, and 4. And so this is what they look like. This is color one. It's a snow white color. And this is what the packaging looks like. And I bought these here in Arizona at um, Dollar Deals. Um, you, can look, you can look up the name and find the location. And so this is number two. And this is a silver. And then this one is a gold. I thought these were super fun colors. So I got these three. There was other colors. I just didn't pick them up at the time because I was picking up other stuff, um, and I wanted to try these and see how I like the formulation. Santi is a product that you can find like on Shop Miss A, but I know they don't sell these because I just placed, well, with three orders, I have three orders coming from Shop Miss A in the last three days because I have a problem. I need a 10 step program. No joke. And I have zero self control when it comes to shopping for makeup so that I can bring you guys everything I find. And I literally put three orders in Shop Miss A to an equivalent of 150 items. So I will break each bag up into individual videos, but I'm probably going to get it all sent in one shot. I did purchase every single one of the brand new AOA matte lipsticks. So I'm going to bring you that as a completely separate video because I, I don't know, I think there's like 45 lipsticks, 50 lipsticks. So, yeah, I'm not going to kill you guys with, like, a six-hour video. So, first up, we're going to test number two. I grabbed the silver. It's what it looks like. Just your typical bullet. It's nice packaging. Kind of heavy. Uh, not heavy, I mean. Um, these are really creamy and smooth for being, like, glittery. And um, if you're not a fan of glitter or high, you know, shimmer on your... Um, and then this one is number one. This is like the Snow White color. And they are creamy. They are smooth. But also because I live in Arizona, um, even though I have the air conditioning on, the heat is still killer out here. So it's hotter than a prostitute on sale. So here we go. So this is going to be color number two. This is the silver. Number one is the Snow White and number four is the gold. You can see it. They're really pretty. They're super metallic-y. They do say they are what they say as far as metallic. Um, I have worn all three of these. Um, and I like them. Um, let's see. I have one purple, but 
Let's see, I have... This is the gold, this is number four. And I have on a clean color, Madly Map, and Frosted Grape, so probably wasn't the most brilliant idea, but really it just, it kind of gives me an ombre effect, but um, it really just enhanced the metallic in the Frosted Grape. And that's the um, clean color, Madly Matte um, lipsticks and Frosted Grape, you can find those on Shop Miss A, and you can find them here in Arizona at Dollar Deals, I know that for sure, because um, that's where I bought most of mine. Um, next up, um, I found these at Dollar Tree, and it's always a wonderful score when you can go to Dollar Tree, pay a dollar for name brand cosmetics. So these are going to be the CoverGirl Lipsticks Schmoochies Lip Balm the XOXO, and I found, they only had these two colors at the particular Dollar Tree I went to. And this is 225, well, it's got three names, so that's kind of crazy. Hashtag tweet me, hashtag, okay, no, it is hashtag tweet me. Sorry, they're in another language. I promise I can read. So this is like a red, these are lip balms. Let's see if I can get the... Trying to, yeah, well, the sticker's crazy. And then the next one I got is like a brown color. Same thing, and it's in 270, hashtag only you. So I'm going to. Um, they are sheer. They are a tinted um, lip gloss, obviously, um, with some uh, sheen in it. I mean, not sheen. With a little bit of shimmer. Uh, well, yeah. No. Um, 225, um, hashtag tweet me, does not have any, so, let's see if you can even see it. So this is 270, hashtag only you, right? Yep. And then this one, this sheer one right here, the uh, reddish is, um, hashtag tweet me, 225. Um, they smell... Super delicious. They both smell kind of like a combination of cherry and strawberry, which I don't mind at all since, as long as it's like a, not a nasty, harsh, you know, knock me dead scent. Um, I'm okay. But I don't mind when, you know, things are scented. Um, I actually prefer my stuff over unscented, um, just because I'm that type of person that will put on Victoria's Secret Lotion, matching spray, matching, you know, um, so not only will I have the body spray, but I'll also have the perfume, too, that matches it, um, that's one thing I love about Victoria's Secret and Bath and Body Works, because you can get those sets, and I'm just like, I like to smell good all day long, until I have to take a shower, I want to know that I'm at least smelling good. And I don't have any foundation on, so if you see me wiping my face, it's because I'm sweating. Even though I have my AC, it's just, it's hot here in Arizona. All right, so the next four um, lip glosses I have, I bought these, and it's the brand Starry. I know you can buy some Starry products on Shop Miss A. Um, I know you can buy them in the 99 cent only store, which is a lie. It's not 99 cent only, so all of you that shop there know their jig is up. They need to change the name of their store. So anyways, these are lip glosses that I found, and um, it was actually two packs of six, but I gave um, some away to a friend who needed a birthday present. So I did that. So I have um, two purpose... It's gradients of pink... Um, and then a, like a bronzy brown. So this is what they look like. They don't have names. So they're, the name brand is Starry. And it just says, Brilliant, Effective Volume Glamour, Dazzling, Glamorous, Lip Plumping Effect. And it says that they're lip plumping. I have not tried these yet. Um, so this is going to be more of like a deeper red pink. So let's see. We'll put this... They are kind of sheer. They do have some shimmer in them, 
Um, it is buildable, so that's nice. They kind of have like a, you know, like uh, you go to your grandma's house and she has the tray of like the plastic fruit on the table. They kind of smell like that and children's Benadryl. Not like the medicine part, the like cherry part or bubblegum. No cherry. So this is the first one. This is the reddish pink tone. The next one I'm going to do is a step down gradient pink. This one's kind of a purpley pink. Um, this one is a heck of a lot more sheer and a lot more shimmer shows up on this one. This is definitely like, a, obviously these would probably more or less be a lip gloss topper. So here's the second one. You can barely see it on my skin. Um, next color we're going to go to is this kind of purpley shade. It's like the first, the second shade I just swatched. So obviously, because I forgot, because I put these away and I forgot about them. So the first and this shade um, are obviously more opaque. And then, so obviously I remembered that there was two separate sets. And in each set, there was one that was more of like a opaque lip gloss set and the other one was more sheer gloss so this one is more opaque and it is a pink purpley tone but hey guess what it's not porn pinks this time <laughs> sex kitten pinks barbie pinks so this is the so, so this one right here and this one are the ones that are a little bit more opaque this one is a sheer formula so i'm not sure if this bronze brown and I love nudes and I love this yeah this one is going to be in the opaque family too but it's they're actually all beautiful um so and let's see um they do have a little stick factor but to be honest now that I just destroyed that swatch I should have done it before I should have showed you before I did that um to be honest with you um, when it comes to this, so this is the, it's like a brownie nude. Almost like a, um, a cross between, if you mixed a butterscotch chip and a chocolate chip together, this is what you would get. Um, they are a little sticky, but I didn't expect to not have it. I don't really like sticky lip glosses. Um, can I tolerate them if I'm like going out to eat or drink? Yes, because they're just going to wear off anyways. And hell, we've all eaten lipstick. So the last um, three items I have in this little short category are going to be Silly City Colors um, lip paints. And I was first turned on to these by Alexis Jada here on YouTube. Um, and she had got hers at uh, Ross. Um, I did have four colors, but unfortunately, I used to have a roommate that stole a bunch of my makeup. Mm -hmm. So nice. Glad a lot of it that she stole was cheap and fake makeup versus my really expensive real stuff because I probably would have lost my mind and hunted her down. Anyhow, so these are city colors, and this all came in a set, and there was another color that came with this set. So I have like a brick um like a berry color this is a brown and this is like a pinky nude these are kind of um so let's see and of course they don't have names but i didn't really expect it to so this is by the brand city color i know you can look that company up online to purchase their products i know that there's a few websites you can go to and gosh darn it i'm sorry but the website is just blinking um and of course, you can go to any Ross in America and find City Color. So I'm going to start with the Berry Wine Color. And these are pretty. I have worn them. Um, this Berry Wine is opaque. They're good. And the cute little thing is they come with a little mirror on the back. So that's always convenient. So this is the Berry Wine Lip Paint. Um, this next one is going to be the pink. 
<laughs> I thought my doe foot was gone. Huh. Nope. Just really small and stuck up inside there. This one has a lot more sheer coverage, which I would expect because of the color gradient that's in it. So this is like the pink. So we're, we're on the, the nudish spectrum. And then this is like going to be like a brownie brown or as Alexis Jada says, um, uh, caca brown. And there ain't nothing wrong with the caca brown, right? So this is going to be the brown. So that would be like your deeper spectrum of your warm nudes. Um, so that's going to be your deeper spectrum on that one. Um, yeah, so, I mean, they're beautiful. Um, they do have a little bit of stick factor. Um, but like I said, oh, my God, excuse me. Hey, you like my little unicorn? Uh, unicorn? Uh. Oh, nice. There's an Amber Alert out of Albuquerque, New Mexico right now. That's where I was born. Excuse me. Sorry about that. I thought I had my phone on vibrate. I greatly appreciate, I greatly apologize for that. That was completely rude. But hey, I guess if they come here, we know that they're wanted. That's just ridiculous. What is with, what, I'm sorry, this is a side note, but what the hell is wrong with people stealing people's kids? Or stealing your own damn kids? Go to court and do it the right way, you fools. Why catch a felony and never see your children for the rest of your life in the name of I'm saving my children? Come on, people. Think about it. I get it. I'm a parent. And I would take a bullet for my children in a heartbeat, just like 99% of the parents out there would. But don't steal your kids and cause commotions like that. That's just, I mean, it's unnecessary. And you're just... You're creating problems that should not be created. Anyways, I digress because that just kind of really bothers me. I have um, I, I have education in um, criminal justice forensics and um, a little bit in criminal behavior psychiatry. Um, I was working towards my PhD for that one um, and my master's in criminal justice forensics. And then um, so nice of a drunk driver to destroy my back. So thanks to that drunk driver... I didn't get to finish, but January, I'm going back now that I got, finally was able after 21 years to get my surgery. So the last I have, so that we're not here for ever in a day, is going to be the uh, Milani Lippies. And I think you can get these at every single Dollar Tree across whatever. Sometimes you can even find them in the 99 cent only store that is not 99 cent only. Um, as we all know, if we all shop there, um, let's see. And I know I think I have two that, see, that's what's bad. It's like when you're a makeup collector and you end up collecting the exact same thing because you swear that color looks different than what you actually have. And then you get home and you're like, nope, got that color. Okay. So I had a lot of these, um, Milani lips and I have two different styles. So I have the Milani, I'm sorry, Lip Intense Liquid Color. And this one is a purple tone and it's 04 Violet Addict. This next one is pink, excuse me, 03 Fiery Coral. Uh, let me turn it so I can actually, well, my bad. And then the next one I have is a red. And it's called um, 01 Red Extreme. Next one is a, here we are with the porn pink again, 02 Pink Rave. So I'll go ahead and swatch these. And then I have other ones. None of these have a name. So I, as I swatch them, I'll describe their colors. So I'm going to go with, and I bought these at um, Dollar Tree also. So let me go in with number one. And I don't know if there was more colors out there, um, but... Um, I'm just going to swatch them all real quick. We're at 19 minutes and I don't want you guys sitting here forever in a day, but feel free to pause the video, go get a snack, a drink. I completely understand. Um,
But anyway, so yeah, um, so I'm going to go back in January and finish out my degrees because I find it's just extremely important to um, in, enforce education, especially nowadays. All right. First one we got is going to be number one, and this is Extreme Red. Number two is going to be Pink Rave. Number three is going to be Fiery Coral. And the last one is going to be Violet Addict. So I don't know if you can really see them. They are variations of red, pink, purple tones. Um, they're really pretty. Um, I have used them before, and I really like them. They don't have a really long stain powder because, um, of course, they're not a matte, so they don't dry down. Um, but they do last for a, a hot minute. Okay, so the next ones I have are these little tubes. You can also find these at Dollar Tree and 99 cent only as well. Um, this one is a brownie. The packaging has huh, the little coloration. This is what it looks like. So the stamping on the outside of the bottle has rubbed off. So this one is going to be like a shimmery brown. And this one is kind of a sheer coverage. I'm just going to swatch them all. Um, next one is going to be a shimmery um, sheer pink. Well, it's pink in the bottle, but it comes out like um, a clear. Next one is going to be a gold and yellow, but, and this is also a sheer coverage. So I don't know on my skin tone if you're really going to be able to see those real sheer ones. This one is a, another sheer, but this is a pink one that has um, glitter in it, different reflex of glitter. This one is a more solid pink, kind of on the Barbie pink, but this is also sheer as well. I didn't realize I... Essentially, I don't think you guys are going to see any of them other than these. Are, this next one is a vampy purple with glitter in it, and it's pretty. And it's sheer also, but it, it does have a little bit more color payoff. All right. The next four are, um, excuse me, this one is a like a brick red-brown. These next ones should, have, yeah, this, they're all in the sheer formula. I'm not sure why. Oh, duh, it says Milani Crystal Gloss. Hello. If, I, if I'd if i read it, I could give you proper information. Yeah. Um, next one is this red. And it's still a sheer formula, but we do have a little bit of color. So, I mean, with these sheer formulas, I look at them and it's something, this is a darker red with glitter in it. Pretty much every single one of these has some form of glitter in it. So, yeah. But, and then this one is a like a cherry red. And, yeah, this one is a deeper hue. All right. So, literally, these would all be lipstick shoppers. Okay, so, you're not going to be able to see any of those. This is like the brown, the white, the yellow. Okay. The next one is that lighter pink, um, just a hair, darker pink, and then this is the brownie, and then down here is that deeper red, a gradient down of the deeper red, mm, another gradient down of the, the deeper red, and then this one is a... Um, deep red with um, multicolored glitter in it. Um, unfortunately, like I said, you're not <laughs> really going to see those, but they are good for, um, let's see, I'll take the little purple one here. And they smell like cupcakes. Nothing worse than your your lips smelling like cupcakes make you hungry for a cupcake all day. <laughs> not that it's going to last all day. Okay. So, not that you're going to be able to tell, but the lipstick I had on underneath 
like I said, was the clean color, madly matte metallic in frosted grape. And then I put that gold right in the center to kind of do like a more metallic ombre with it. But it's now glossy. It's enhanced it a little bit. I can do that and it's not sticking. So, I mean, it's pleasant. Um, and it's doable. Um, thanks for watching my video. I'm going to go now. Um, and like I said, like and subscribe. Um, let me know if you have a channel in the comments and I will subscribe to you as well. Um, I look forward to seeing you guys on my next video. Have a good day. I'll talk to you later. Bye.